season mother funking too. You heard me. A lot of people cannot take criticism. They not socially conditioned. They have this new school aura and new school energy of like, yo, bro, what about my feelings? <laughs> Nigga, I don't give a fuck about your feelings. Straight up and down like that. I don't give a fuck about nobody's feelings, bro. Unless it's we talking about my children. And even nine times out of 10, I don't give a fuck about their feelings neither. It's what needs to be done. So yeah, some people can't take criticism because their mind's not like that. They can't hear somebody say some shit and they be like, yo, you're projecting, bro, you whack. Because again, is your question, how can we get it done? Or is your question not a question? It's just a bro. I don't really know how that's gonna happen. Oh, you don't? Cool. What else you got for me? That that was your contribution. Lonely, wife being too much woman for you. Poor baby. You haven't seen the level one podcast today, huh? Are you aching for another regurgitating video made about Phil? Well, grab a bottle of your favorite lubricant. Turn the lights down low and let your favorite fake detractor take you on a bacon greased, seductive ride with the juicy man meat that is Phil. Get your fill with Phil. Saddle up. to the table when I'm the table. Stop. <laughs> Wait, guys, we don't need girls. We could just go back to the basement and watch porn and pretend we're not looking at each other jerk off. <laughs> <laughs> because you know uh, uh, us <laughs> Okay, let's move on to the slurp room, or the, like the slurp ramp kind of section of this playroom at Steamworks. Now, not every bathhouse is gonna have this, but I have seen it in more than just this place, so it is a thing. What you do is you walk up the steps, and then you can walk around the top part of this slurp room, and it's got glory holes all along the way, so it can accommodate many different people and people just walk along with it they look down at the crowd they can stick it through the holes and then the people that are on the lower section of course are milling about you look up you see something you like boop, pops up through the hole bam you take it it's yours so now let's watch this in context to what's actually going on with our man doofus which, again, if you understand, look, Doofus is exactly George Santos in every way possible. They're, they are a one-to-one -to, -one to each other, except he's married and who, who the fuck cares if, if, if he Doofus is married or not. But otherwise, they're the exact same dude. Sexuality, the tone, how they look at life, how they lie about everything, all the same dudes. They are like telling you the epitome of the same dudes. So let's watch and see this in context and have some fun. District where this previous hotel that closed down during COVID um, was sold in the dead of night in, in an organization and in a you, very you, illegal act. You, you mean sold in the dead of night, which it, which in a, in a nutshell basically means it was uh, that was the last minute deal that they did and they wanted to finalize that deal before anybody reneged and went back on their draw. That's pretty much what he what happened. Now let's continue. Between the county of Nassau with an organization to set up 80 homeless families. We have nothing against homeless people or homeless families. This is not a residential area. 
this will destroy the community if it goes in the way about that they're trying to do it. They're trying to strong arm it on the residents of Jericho and I'm not standing for it and I'm fighting for it. Join me as you see all the people that are coming out and asking for transparency. It's a lot, isn't it? They're asking for no illegal shelter. And we're here to fight. Look, 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 who people this? are going by. They're honking. They're supporting us. Do you patients. hear These one honk happen? Who pay their taxes? Why is everybody? They why did? Why did? Why did? Uh, they deserve transparency. Why did Dupas bring his family out here? Right? Yes. Look, he yes. used his fiat, man. Come right. on. We all want transparency, this. and we want to make sure that this this project Look, does not happen listen, listen because this it's part. illegal. Watch the way they lady about say it yes is illegal. when this he's trying to make a point where he's supposed to say no. This is no residential area. There's no place. For an illegal, for an illegal or homeless shelter of any kind, we want transparency. The kids are out there. Are we going to jeopardize the school districts for the children and the people who pay all the high taxes to have a quality of life? They said yes. That's okay. This that is trolling one on one, brothers and sisters. That is trolling one on one. None of this is real. This is all staged. He went and got his family and friends to come out here. And make up this fake petition that's, we're outraged. Don't you hear the cars honking? Man, the car almost ran him over and said, get out the way, Bluto. We trying to get to work. Then he says that this is not a residential area. It's a medical center. And behind him, there actually are apartments. So, yes, yes. Because remember, this is a hotel. It's a former hotel. So, yes, yes, yes. To all of this crap, it's all crap. Oh, this guy is all doofus, man. You bring many laughs, bro. Many, many laughs, doofus. You keep content creating air quotes over here, bro. You keep it up. Are we going to be anti-American and destroy the future of our children? Is that what we're about? This is America. Look, it's a free look, country. Nobody cares. That's why we're here. Look Nobody can. They stand around waiting on the barbecue. Because of what's going on. Because look, Nassau County look, has failed all them. Them. Look at all these Leadership people. Leadership has look. failed them. And their children You know what? I bet you these people are waiting on the bus. Is that what we're here he said, for? hey, I'll give you guys each bus fare if I can put America? these fake signs in. Is that why in. my parents came to America? Look, look, I don't look, think look. so. So you see, this was... <laughs> so you see this cartoon character. Is just doing the same thing he's always done. Lie his ass to fake ass stardom. <laughs> so you see why he's at the head of the only the only Fields fan club. Because <laughs> he definitely never was. A detractor. You can't. How you gonna hold somebody accountable when you lying? Come on, man. What is it? Bruh. Come on, bruh. Come on, dog. Come on back to Kansas, Dorothy. Come on, man. I'll see you guys in a little bit. If you hope we wouldn't make it, funk you. Talk with a heart full of hatred, funk you. Those who talk tough but run from us. Mother sucker funk you. Love Sam. And now, our feature presentation. Three, yes! Ties it at 85, off the rub, they went under the pick and gave him a lot of room. To look at Kobe's last basket go under and he knocks down the three the tie to Kobe beyond the arc does it again a couple of threes by Kobe from distance <laughs> the Doka says wow out of the timeout with Lamar finding Kobe beyond the arc again and again comes through in the clutch yet another bomb I mean catch fire the result splash Kobe will get it from Kwame now Kobe for the tie Got it! Did it again! For 56. Zach Randolph, got to get closer than that. Got to pick it up. Here's the double, double. Kobe, 
Hard to believe. Are you That's kidding it. me? Unreal! Are you kidding me? How strong was that? A triple on a fall away in the corner with a shot clock down. Lakers by three. You have got to be joking. I thought there was going to be a foul there. And I don't even know when he found sight uh, of the basket. All of a sudden, splash. I mean, good God. 199 with 48 seconds to play. A gift. Lakers had a chance to put it away, and now they find themselves down by one. Inside of 40 seconds left. Andrew Bynum back on the floor of the pick. Kobe gave up the dribble. Kobe, the long three. Yes! The best finisher in the game has just done it again. 102-100, Lakers. <laughs> he looks up at the crowd and gives them that look like, why are you so, why are you so surprised? That's what I do. The free throw line that really counts. Missed them both. The Lakers get it back. Great! Kobe! Butter! Tied at 95! Three seconds left. He wants an isolation to work with Brown. Now to three seconds. Kobe lost the triple. In a hurry, he has to pick it up. Desperation three. My goodness. Kobe Bryant puts the Lakers up by two. Look, look, look where he is right here. There's the 28 foot line. All right, man. No time on that. This team is not headed for the playoffs. Payton. Bryant out top against Patterson. Kobe cannot get Patterson in the air. A wild three. He hit it. Just when you think the basketball gods can't get any cooler. No, I've told you before, this is not the guy you want to let shoot the shot in this building. It seems to be home for him. And with one, one left, Kobe Bryant ties the ball game up as only Kobe Bryant. If he makes it, he makes it. Payton to inbound. Bryant for three. <laughs> because, he was the back of the because, you know, uh, uh, <laughs> so here's the uh, here we go with part two. Of, I don't know if he really considered a part two, but we definitely are gonna. Sh I'm gonna show you exactly how and why the burial happened as fast as it did. Uh, like, get yeah, it about a month and a week. This whole thing was already settled and done. And if, if I may uh, be so bold, it, it it came and went with a whimper. So they were they were rolled up pretty quick. So now we got to understand the why they rolled up pretty quick, why they decided to go down the road of effeminate passive aggressiveness versus direct confrontation. You know, I'm going to show you how they framed situations with me to try to change the narrative to their to their side of thinking. So what you're about to see here is Rachel Maddow and and. And she invited some other folks so they could discuss the uh, women and uh, men pay range or pay gaps, you know, correctly. And it's just interesting how, um, well, you, you'll, be, you'll be able to see it. So you can see the narrative set up and then, you, then you'll see someone come in with the truth. And then you'll see her say, well, no, 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 we're not worried about the truth. We just want to know how you feel about it. Y'all got to watch. Whether it was the health care bill that women oppose, they wanted a different direction. How, Rachel, should this conversation actually be framed? 
I, I made the comment when I've been, done this topic before. In a lot of ways, you know, men bringing up this question, it's almost a condescending question. Well, what is it that women want? Right. So what is the right way to be framing this conversation in this debate, which is a very serious debate, because we're talking about the real deciders in the race? Policy. It should be about policy. And all of our best debates are always about policy. And it should be about policy that affects women specifically. The Romney campaign wants to talk about women and the economy. The Okay, real quick, you heard what she said, right? It should be about policy. Well, the policy is what? What is the actuality of what's going on and how to change it, how to make it better? So those are the or in, or a policy could be an opinion about what can be made better and then put into place. So let's take a look real quick and then we'll be right back with Rachel before we get to the good stuff. All right, so just, again, bear with me, family. I know that you guys know what this means, but it just goes to making content and, you know, something that the, the Phil fan uh, creation does not understand. Those kind of content creators, theirs is pretty much copy and paste and hope that you like it. I mean, it's pretty much based on that. It has no imagination. It has no grit. It has nothing. It's just as empty. No wonder they fit so well in that damn casket. So, um... We look at a course or principle of action adopted or proposed by a government, a party, business, or individual, a policy. So we, we can consider house rules. You know, the the dishes are done every day at 7 or 8 or where That could be a policy. It's something that is instituted by an individual or the, the, the mom and dad, things like that. Again, y'all know what that means, but listen to this part. Policy is a law, a regulation, a procedure, an administrative action, an incentive, or a voluntary practice of government and other institutions. So she, th this is where things, the conversations should be framed, okay? So she agrees with this. This is where all the, the debates that, that are useful and are healthy happen within this part. Now that we know that, watch what she does. Which is exactly what the what the only feels content creators did. The OCs. What this is it's exactly what they would do. Be right back. Women women in this country still make seventy seven cents on the dollar for what men make. So if yeah, exactly. women don't make less than men? Actually, if you start looking at the numbers, Rachel, uh, there are lots of reasons for that. Wait, wait, wait. No wait. Well, Don't tell me all, the reasons are. Do women make less than men for the, doing actually, the same work? Uh, Not the no, same work. because... Wow! Well, okay. okay, well, well for we're example, men work, men work an average of 44 hours a week. Women work 41 hours a week. Men go into professions like engineering, science, and math that earn more. Women want more listen, flexible Listen, this is not a math is hard No, no, no. Yes, it is, actually. No, it isn't. Well, no, listen. Look. What? Oh. So, you see a couple of things there, which is pretty much exactly how the uh the only feels content creators do they they want to try to change or come with a narrative about feel they want to come with a narrative about me they want to come to all these things but don't have any credible or factual <coughs> statements to make up you know at least when i do content i try to do outwardly funny stuff so that way you know it's funny and then when it's come down to the serious things i back that thing up with what what they're actually doing, the actual facts of the case. Doesn't matter about the conjecture and the maybes. No, it this is what it is. And when you state it and you make that frame and you make that claim, for me to be wrong, it's easily provable, right? Just if you can prove that that's not the case, by all means, bring it on. They're not even willing to engage in that because guess what? They can't because they know eventually where it's going to go. It's going to lead back to, so what's the purpose of your channel? And they're not going to want to defend that. So you see here, and what was, was what you saw there, was when she said women what uh, make less than men, it's like 77 cents on a dollar. The minute she said that, and he says, ah, that's the, the data doesn't support that. The facts don't support that. And then he's, then he's going to tell you why the facts don't support it. So he's going to tell you what was looked at here, what was, no, no, don't give me the reasoning. Just tell me you don't believe it. Well, did you, that's a, that was a tactic that he saw that she was going to try to control the narrative. Very important. Did you understand that, that remember the, what the guy did? He says, well, well, Rachel, if you could frame it, which is what? 
What what does the framing mean? To control the narrative is about policy, right? We ain't talked about policy yet. Notice that? We're discussing, she said, what she already had in her mind, women are going to earn less than men. And he says, well, well, hold on. Technically speaking, if you're looking at the data, though it's, it's not necessarily what you think it is. And it's true. It is super true. And we couldn't even get to that point to argue that point because she had no interest. She had her own narrative that she wanted to say, and damn the damn the truth. Let's just go with what I believe. You'll see her say that too. Well, what, what I believe is that women make 77 cents. I don't give a damn what you believe. It don't look, the truth don't need what you what you think it is. The truth is the truth. Well, I don't think that I, I just don't think that 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 I'm not a, a detractor. It, it don't matter what you think. It matters. The truth is you're not. Facts. That's it. It's all that matters, right? The facts is all that matters. And they are so confused and deluded that they have they have managed and successfully, mind you, have you thinking that what they're putting out about feel are factuals. They're truths. Look, they're putting out stuff that's been regurgitated already. That's already been found out. You know, they're all putting together something of some form or fashion that you've already seen. And they've just redone it. It's like Sonic trying to redo a hamburger. There, it, it's, it's just a hamburger, dog. There, you cannot do X amount of stuff with that much with a hamburger. Fud Ruckers tried, and you see that they ain't doing good in business. You just that's not what's gonna keep drawing customers in. At the end of the day, people really like simplicity, right? You're right or wrong. Simple. I got other, I, I'm I'm already doing stuff at work that and I got I got my kids at home. I got other responsibilities. I don't need this overcomplicated crap. Just give me the, the straight up facts. But see, if you start living like the like the the only feels, then you get to you get you get to uh, leverage an option that nobody else gets to fight on. We're going to put like, what was it? We're going to make a spot on video about Eric. Did I verify anything in there? I'm willing, more than willing to do it. I'm more than willing. But we got to get around what the original problem is first. The whole thing that started this thing, immorality and cyberbullying. I'd love to talk about the things outside of that, but we still got to talk about that thing first. That's what it means to stay focused on the issue. See that sidetracking? That's what you do when you want to try to frame somebody in one area. Like him, I ain't interested in that. I'm going to tell you what the facts are, and we're going to deal with that. And then if you, we can go on your little fact-finding mission, do whatever the hell you want. But it has, it's beyond me. The truth is beyond me. That's a fact. I don't control it. I don't dictate it. I just call it as it is. It it don't need to benefit me to be the truth. It doesn't matter what I think. It doesn't matter what I feel. It matters what the truth is. Jesus, huge on that, right? The truth shall set you free. Well, what is one of the things that we understand? Don't lie to one another. Don't tell stories. Well, the star is from the only fields. That's all they got is stories. They don't have anything else. There's, there's nothing else. Sorry about that. My battery's dying. They don't have anything else to give to this world other than taxes. That's all they got. They got nothing else to give this world on any level. Again, they are useless and worthless. Now, if they just say, look, we're just trolls, man. We're not detractors. <laughs> hey, I knew that all the time. So you need to tell yourself that, not me. Well, sort of, because I do want people to know that they're not detractors because they're not holding Phil accountable. They can't. We, I think I discussed that at, at, at length up to this point. It is impossible for them to hold. There's that word again. It's impossible for them to hold anybody accountable when they don't even hold their own selves accountable and, and their friends and other folks like that. Everybody knew, knows full well Doofus is a lying son of a bitch. But is there anybody else that's trying to say, hey, as a collective, you got to stop doing No. 
Nope, he gets all invited to the reindeer games. Because if one domino falls, they all get hit. Because he represents exactly what is wrong with this entire community. That's why we had to put them in the dirt. We had to kill them bastards. We had to put them under and leave them under there. So once again, we had to put them in that damn casket. So that way the rest of people that are out here that are living can breathe. I am, I'm not the gatekeeper. I'm not. Or as one person said, maybe you should be. Until until it gets clean. Who are you to do that stuff? A person that believes in this community. I believe in y'all. I believe even in those trolls that still want to feed off of Philip. I believe that y'all can want better. I am the last attractor y'all got that will and hold someone accountable and that includes myself. They ain't about making money off of Phil. It's make sure that what Phil is held accountable to the lies and the stuff that he does. And the only way that can happen is we got to have a conversation with him. And since we can't have a conversation with him because of the only feels, they all had to what say it with me. They had to get it in that damn casket. And so that's where we are right now. So you 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 see he. She wanted to go to the, um, uh, what do you call it? She wanted to go to the belief system because that's where she really wanted to make things happen. She wanted to go there to, well, see, I'm going to frame it this way because if I can frame it this way, I can go about it on this other. Yeah, yeah, we know that. That's why we stay to the issues, man. We won't let them go down that road. And you should not allow the OnlyFans content creators, you shouldn't allow them to just get away with trying to say something that they're not. Let hey, Eric, Eric Berry, y'all, y'all can't be using that term. Yes, tell them. I'm, I look, and I, and I know y'all don't like me. There's many out there that don't like me, and I can respect that. I really do. But just know that I did this for you. You should be able to, you should be able to enjoy good trolling without you feeding into the negative narrative. You should be able to feel that. I troll all the time. Every day I'm trolling. Don't it, I don't mind, but I also have a goal in mind. There's a reason for it. It's not to shut somebody up. It's not to belittle them. It's to, hey, let's have this conversation. Let's have this conversation about the right things. And if we're not going to do that, well, then I'm a troll until you get sick of it, until we can talk about the right thing. Remember that forever petty engine I got? It happens a lot. Okay, man, I'm done. You just won't listen. Oh, oh, so okay. So now we've reached a point to where now you know what it feels like. Now that we got there, are you now willing to talk about it now? Are we? Can we now get down to business? This is what I do. Let's get back to it and see how worse this gets. Whew, it gets weird. Right, let Rachel frame, frame let me, it, though, the way Rachel, she right now, laid it up. Women are making 77 cents on the dollar but, for, that, for, for what men are making. So, but that's not if I, true. So, if so, every, right, let greedy, Rachel make her point. every greedy businessman in America would hire only women, save 25%, and, and be hugely this is, this is. I feel like this is actually, it's just, and it's weird that you're interrupting me and not letting me make my point, because we get along so well. So um, let me make my point. I will. But, and, and that's where we get to the next phase of the problem with the only fields is what? They don't want to hear the facts, baby. They just want to make their point. That's what their videos about me, all it is. They're trying to make a point about me that isn't a point at all because I ain't there. I'm not there to dispute anything. I'm not involved in that whole process. So guess what? It's just their opinion. And they want it that way because they don't get the opportunity to be a man and come talk to me directly. So... They make that little weak, pathetic videos about me. And you're, you're very welcome because giving them something to talk about other than Philip is, is, is hard enough. But you know what? Leave it to your boy to be able to co conquer that problem by being more interesting to talk about because I am.
It's just that simple. When you are the last detractor standing, you kind of have to start taking some hits. And again, that's why you see the pink casket. Why? The the effeminate behavior, the in the closet behavior, we put all that in that damn casket. So that way you know where they sit, you know where they're standing. And the thing about it is they they truly, truly, truly want to push this narrative as somehow I, I'm crazy because I'm going against them. As if like, who the hell are you? Who do you think you are to where I need to be worried about you? That who what are you high? How what when when was it that you became something that's supposed to be important for me to have to think about? Last time I checked, you ain't shit. So that means you don't come, you don't even register high enough to be next to a Slurpee. That's that's it, that's it, or an icy. That's it. It's just not that you're not that important, though. You're just not. That was one thing that some of what well, Julius Cruz talked about is you're going crazy. You're doing a jihad. Uh, okay. So the fact that I'm calling all of y'all punk asses out for not being detractors, for being only fields, I'm waging a jihad. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay, my friend. You got it. <laughs> you got it, Playboy. I don't. Okay. <laughs> All right then. Uh, whatever makes you feel better at night, homie. But no, you know, you know what really is happening is what y'all all know to be true. All they want to do is paint a narrative. That's why Philip don't take them serious because they have the narrative of Philip. They don't have him confirming a damn thing. And until you get his confirmation, all you got is conjecture and an opinion. And it's one sided at that because he ain't talking to you. You see what I'm saying? That's where you get the doofuses, the snorts, and the and, and the the and teeth and uh what sloppy sloppy king, queen of the sloppy, whatever. And then you got prostitute games. You got and you got the rest of them. This is just all a sham, brothers and sisters. A damn scam to keep them employed. And it, it's it's just terrible to watch. If they just came out and said, yeah, we're trolls. We're not trying to do nothing but make money off field. Man, I could respect that. I really, really could. I'm not saying that to be funny. I could respect that if they came out and said it. They're not. But, you know, they, they really are delusional. Think they can hold field, field accountable. But, hey. You know, um, there are people out there that really believe that Jedi's are real. So <laughs> they really believe that the Matrix is real. So you know, hey man, it's it's, it's you want to call yourself an attractor, you go right ahead, brother. You got people wanting to call themselves anything but what they are, with in reality what they are. But it doesn't make any of that true because you're a lying sack of shit and. You're not a detractor. I'm it. I want you guys to know I'll embrace you. I'll hold you. I'll I'll open my arms up willingly. I, I can let bygones be bygones. Why? Because I don't go nowhere without your help. We can go together and raise hell. We don't need them. People that are just going to eat and take away from what this community used to be, because that's all the only fields do. They're the ones who killed the detractor community over time. I just put that damn thing out of its misery, and then we got a phoenix on our hands. We can rise out of the ashes. I'm the last man standing, brothers and sisters. I'm like an institution. I'm like a monument. I'm forever-ish. And I'm forgiven. Oh, I want to forgive. I want to open my arms up. I want to say, look, man, let's go ahead and heal this rift that we may have. I want to heal damage, uh, damage bridges. I'm willing. I just ask for you to be a man. That's all I ask. It is important, I think. The interruption is important, I think, because now we know at least from both of your perspective, that women are not faring worse than men in the economy, that women aren't getting paid less for equal work. I think that's a serious basis, a, a, difference, in, a difference in factual understanding of the world. But 
given that some of us believe that women are getting paid less than men for doing the same work. There is something called the Fair Pay Act. There was a court ruling that said the statute of limitations, if you're getting paid less than a man, if you're subject to discrimination, starts before you know that discrimination is happening, effectively cutting off your recourse to the courts. You didn't know you were being discriminated against, you can't go. The first law passed by this administration is the Fair Pay Act to remedy that court ruling. The Mitt Romney campaign put you out as a surrogate to talk to shore up people's feelings about this issue after they could not say whether or not Mitt Romney would have signed that bill. You're supposed to make us feel better about it. You voted against the Fair Pay Act. It's not about whether or not you have bill. a female surrogate. It's about policy and whether or not you want to fix some of the, right. su the, the structural discrimination that women really do face that Republicans don't believe is happening. It's policy is the argument. It's policy. And I love how passionate you are. I wish you were as right as, about what you're saying as you are passionate about it. I really do. That's For really example, condescending. No. You're, there, I mean, this is a I think the interruption is important, I think, because now we know, at least from both of your perspective, that women are not faring worse than men in the economy, that women aren't getting paid less for equal work. I think that's a serious basis, a, a, difference, in, a difference in factual understanding of the world. But given... What factual understanding of the world. So you understand what she's saying, right? Well, even though the statistics show it, 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 it's it's just a different interpretive a narrative versus versus what Rachel? Come on, my love. What is it? What is the what? Is, what are we saying? She doesn't have anything. It's an interesting interpretation that women aren't faring worse than men. That's not an interpretation. That's a fact. That's how these guys work. You haven't seen the true Philip in so long. You look. It's it's easy to say this. You probably haven't seen Philip. Until after Tevin. That's 100%. You haven't seen a, an innocent representation of him since after Tevin. That, that's safe to say. If I want to be charitable, which I'm merciful. That's why I leave my comment section. Sec, the chat on when I do live. Because see, here's the thing. I want, just, just to answer this question again. I'm, the chat is for y'all. It ain't for me. I don't look at that damn thing. But I do give y'all the, the the premiere to be able to run your mouth about whatever you want. And I'm merciful to do that. I don't take that away. I let it be there and I go about my business and y'all can talk as much as you want. Because we all know, ain't nobody going to come to talk to me directly, are they? <laughs> so I get y'all that, just get in there, gossip and do what you got to do. And then when you're ready to talk as a man, you know, hey, I'm, I'm always right here. I know it's hard. I know it's hard, baby. That's what it is. But anyway, back to Rachel. So she's asked, that's a, this, a interesting interpret a factual interpretation of the world. It you don't look, the truth is the truth. You don't have to interpret it at all. It is the truth. It is what is said. These are statistics. See, what bothered her most was also another woman agreed with him. Because you agree with the facts. But now you're about to see what it's all about. Here's where she, she, she her factual interpretation of the world. Let me show you what she's placed above the facts. Some of us believe that women are getting paid less than men for doing the same. Whoa, 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 whoa. Some of us believe. Let's go ahead. Go back again. Let's listen to where she starts. Given that some of us believe that women are getting paid less than men for doing the same work, there is something called the Fair Pay Act. There was a court ruling that said the Look at his face. Look at her. She's a yes man, lady. Subject to discrimination. Start Look at him. Watch my man. Look. Look at him. He's like, oh my God. Cutting off your recourse to the courts. You didn't know you were being discriminated look at this. against. You can't go. The first law passed by this administration is the look, Fair look, Pay look. Act to remedy that court ruling. The Mitt Romney you see him? He's, put he's, you out as a surrogate to talk to shore up people's feelings about this issue after they could not say whether or not so now she's attacking that bill. now she's attacking that now she's attacking the you policy voted against the fair pay act it's not about whether or not you have bill. a female surrogate it's about policy and whether or not you want to fix some of the right. su the, the structural discrimination listen that women really do face that republicans don't believe is happening it's policy listen. is the argument it's policy. listen and i love how passionate you are i wish you were as right as, about what you're saying as you are passionate about it i really do That's for really example condescending no. Here's the, i mean this is <laughs> Let's add something in that before. Let's add something in that that I saw from Morocco TV. That's what I'm talking about. That's why he's the MVP. That's why he's the GOAT. 
Do you know how Andrew Tate is? Sadly, yes. Yes, how, how do you feel about him? I do not like him. You don't like the top G? No. <laughs> Why? Give me a reason. He's... Yeah, exactly. He's... he's. he's it's fine to dislike someone, but when you've not got a reason for it, you just sound stupid. And this is what happens now. People just follow the masses. If they've heard that everybody hates one person, then they've all got to follow and hate that person as well. And the reason being is because most people are sheep. And that's not just now that it started to happen. This has happened forever. It's just being exposed more of social media and Twitter and all this cancel culture. You can dislike Andrew Tate, you can dislike Donald Trump, Kim Kardashian, but if you don't have your own reasons for it and you're just doing it because everyone else does, you're a muppet. So there it is in a lot of ways. It's it's ah, these brothers and their feelings, dog. It's it's sad. They oh it drives me bonkers. They are straight up in their feelings. Why? Because that's all they got. Dog, they don't have anything else. Look, it, it's one thing to to hate on me. To be just, I can't stand here. I can't stand here. For what reason you don't like me, dog? Because you talked about, but, but you talked about my only feels. But I was right about them. Yeah, but that's, you talked about them, dog. Dog, hold up, man. I'm, I was right about them. I am right about them. I've been nothing but right about them. <laughs> well, I don't like you because you talked about them. Okay, so you don't care that about the truth? Uh, clearly not, because we we take in doofus. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Y'all do take in Doofus, huh? And did you know Doofus has his one of his closest friends? He told me they play around together a lot and they just have a good time. And, you know, that 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 house nigga, uh, 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 Chocolatito, whatever his name, Chili Willy. That's it. <laughs> so we haven't talked to Chili Willy yet, have we? Because no, he ain't important. That's why he ain't been in here. He ain't been important. He don't do shit. He's a copy and paste brother from a copy and paste brother. That's that's sad. You're a copy of a copy, dog. That's terrible. Well, let's talk about it. Let's go ahead and get him involved in the conversation because he's all in his feelings. So let's see. We, let's have some fun. So today we got our man Chili Willie in the building. Okay, Chili. Tell us about yourself, Chili. Come and tell it. I like to have smoking weed right now, and I'm also sipping that scissor. Uh, you mean you you take a Nyquil? Yeah, cause you ain't you know real brothers in the hood. They do scissor. You don't you don't get none of that, right? Well, no, I just wanted to sound cool, cause I'm over here smoking out. Oh, okay, okay there, bud. So, um, uh, you, you when I said that uh, doofus lies. And he does. It's proven he does. He lies. And you jumped in, in my comment telling me, how dare you? How dare you? How dare you? And, you know, you and Snort Hogan got all butthurt. Uh, tell me tell me again, what is the reason for disliking me for defending myself against a statement that turned out to be true? Let me just let's find out. Well, you know, you, you talked about my boy and, you know, that's my boy. I, okay, dog, I get that, but can you help me understand, like, he said some stuff, I said it was a joke, he said some things that were, which I didn't have to read them because they were shit, um, but then you immediately jumped in because Snort Hogan and, and went and, because he said, you you don't have the balls to go on Chill Mary Street, who would want to go on Chill Mary Street, who the fuck cares, do you know what it's like being in one of them, it's like being in five o'clock traffic, it sucks. There's nothing in it. You're going to hear him cuss a million and one times without actually making a point. And that's about it. And you go, he going to talk about how high he is. And, you know, it's funny. For the longest, I actually thought he was a woman because I saw that. I saw, I heard the voice and I saw that picture of that cartoon character with the blunt. That's a woman. If that's a dude, I'm surprised. That is a woman. That's what it seemed like. But, you know, clearly that's his the embodiment of who he is because, you know, he's effeminate and smokes blunt and, and, and is in the house nigga. So um, I just want to know, uh, Chili Willie, so tell me, so the fact that I, that I said he's a plagiarist and it was a joke and then and then uh, then your boy Snotty 
makes a video about me, which was awful, by the way. He, he's, he didn't even have the right perspective in putting my picture in there. It was all slanted. And, and I mean, I didn't do that to him. I wouldn't make, make him. Well, oh, my bad. We don't know what he looks like. My bad. Well, yeah, I don't make the cartoon look all slanted and stuff like that. Get your ratios together, dog. It was terrible. And he was talking a lot of hot mess with nothing in it. It was empty. It was empty like his, like his manhood. It was just not there. But remember, you jumped on my, you jumped in there and was talking all this man. You know, then you said, I'm not a real Christian. As if you know what the fuck that even looks like. You dyke wannabe. That's what, that, that's, you, you don't even know what that even means. You said to yourself, I, don't know what, I interpreted God different. That ain't God, dude. That's your stupidity. God don't think like you. Are you stupid? He says, my ways are not your ways. My thoughts are not your thoughts. My thoughts are higher than your thoughts. How the hell are you going to sit up there and you tell me what you think God should look like? And Man, are you high? If I could super kick your ass with, with Shawn Michaels' leg, I would. That was the most cringy ass backwards thing I've ever heard. That's why I just left. I was like, I, yeah, okay, I'm out of here. But hey, everybody's stupid and everybody's stupid once and everybody's high once. You know, once in a while, not him. He's high every day because when you when you live in your own brain and you're a chill Murray, you have to get high. Who wants to live in that damn Walsh nest? But anyway, let's keep going. So, Chili, tell me you jump. You, that's your boy. And you you just love him to death. Yeah, I love him. Doofus dreams. All right. So Doofus is a liar. What do you feel about that? He's my boy. Doofus dreams. OK, I get that. But he's a liar. And people know him to make up conspiracy theories and bullshit. And you defend that? That's my boy. I'm going to defend it. Ooh, Lord have mercy. I talked to your parents yesterday, man. They, they, yeah. I told them they should have returned you to the earth. But they're not, they're not, is they're not Muslims. And they're not, they don't, they don't do the Islam, so they can't. So now I got to deal with it. So, Sheila, you want to have a, an opinion of yourself? No, man, I, I go with the crowd. Oh, you go with the only fields. Yeah, whatever they do, I do. Woo House Negro. Okay. I, okay, I got you. All right, Malcolm X was so right about your kind. All right, so uh just to get just to get some perspective. You're you you do not like me because I I I said plagiarist and joked about it, and you didn't inquire if it was a joke or not. You didn't inquire to find out what was what was this. You just went into instantaneous suck up to an effeminate boy that robs people like Philip of their content because he can't make any of his own. Am I getting that right? Well, you know, you take content. I say I take clips, but I commentate a lot more than the clip. The clips don't carry my videos, do they? Well, no, exactly. And I'm usually, but usually, I am usually try to be, uh, somewhat educational in some department right yeah and i always try to leave with some kind of hope and love right yeah and i do this all with a sane mind and brain i mean i ain't high i ain't drunk i'm not <laughs> i'm not having any of these issues but you seem to be making content when you only have those things going on. Is that is that about right? I'm always high, baby. I you, I live in Chill Mary's head. You're not Chill Mary, dog. That's not your real name. Yes, it is, player. I know what it is. I know who I am. You don't know who you are, dude. You're a cartoon character and, and a 3D image. You don't. That's not who you are. Yes, I am. I'm just as I have the same kind of depth of, of personality of a 3D rendered. Cartoon character dog, you telling me that that's you? That's me, baby. <laughs> Did you just laugh at a at the idea that you're talking about yourself in third person? Was that doing that? Yeah, dog. You were doing that, man. Are you okay? Man, like we're smoking Drano. How do you smoke Drano, dog? Well, I dip my I dip my weed in the Drano, and then I just I wait till it dries up. <laughs> And then I smoke it. 
Yeah, everybody go ahead and clap for uh, Chili Willy. We just go, we just gonna move him along, and we go. go. <laughs> We gonna move him along and just, but this is what this is what this is what this community is built from. This is what uh, this is this whole. You talk about one, you talk about them all, and it it, it just it, it never makes any sense when I see stuff like this. It's it's weird. It's creepy. It's cringy. Like I don't just hate somebody just because somebody else do. I I ain't built like that. So just because that man has a beef. With that man, they had to beef together. Doesn't automatically side with, with with my boy. He's my friend, sure, but if I'm gonna side with somebody, I'm gonna look at the truth first. What was really happening? And if I can't, and if and if especially if my boy, if my boy, if, especially is in part of this, I'm gonna hold him more accountable to say, hey, dude, look, before you do that, man, try this. I'm gonna be harder on him. Not the person that's attacking it, but maybe that's just me. I like people who tell the truth around me. Yeah, maybe my standard of living is definitely much higher than theirs. Well, it's not a surprise because I am higher than they are. In the sense of what morality, what to do, make sure that you incorporate others and you try to listen to their feelings involved, even though definitely your feelings don't really fucking matter. But, you know, I will listen. And I give everyone that opportunity to talk, to voice their concerns, and they they want to do it in a manner to where they get back up and support. That's bullshit. You mean you can't stand on your own? You you, you can't stand on your own and say, "Man, this is what it's like. This is what I, this is what's going on in my life, and this is how it works." Okay, um, but do you stand on your own? Well, yeah, but if you attack one, one only feels we all come running. Oh, y'all are all house niggas. Okay, that makes more sense now. That's why when I hit one, all of y'all feel it. I get it. And I know you guys are probably wondering, like, why Kobe? Like, why Kobe? God rest his soul. Why Kobe, right? Uh, it's something that was told to me about a year ago. About when, uh, when I, the way the ability for me to get hold of... Um, the reform theology and shut them down in such a small in such a fast and small manner. What does small mean? I don't have to really say too much. I just have to ask the question, which is the, which has always been the same. What does the Bible say about that? And that would just blow them up. Like, that's not what you should hear with the theology. I said, I don't want to hear what anybody says, but the Lord, I don't need a perspective on something. I need to know what the truth is. And each one of these only fields have a perspective of Philip, but they all condone the same pattern of thinking and behavior none of them have a different spin on anything i'm the only thing that did again i'm the only detractor i'm it you got reason why kobe's well what because i don't i don't miss my shot i was raining down threes in this community on them only fields to watch them do absolutely the opposite of what a man does to handle business. I told you they was going to run the other direction. They did it. I told you all they go do is make mean videos. They did it. They'll tell you they go do illegal things and try to dox me and things of that nature. They did it. It's, it's gotten to a point now where again, when I, had, when I decided to bury him because there was nothing else to do. It was done. Finito. I realized that they were never going to be men. I realized that this, it wasn't ever about trying to get to the root of the problem. It never was about trying to uh, make sure there's not, there's not a breakdown in some city. No, no. All it was, was he said something against doofus. Now let's go after him. And I'm like, you know what? This is, this, this, this is the wrong kind of war you want to have with me, homie. I'm, I'm searching for the facts. You trying to search for personal things. And I'm like, you go right ahead and you do whatever you got to do. But I tell you what, I'm going to get down to the facts and I'm going to show them. And y'all go do the opposite, right? Y'all go run the other direction, which I have. I'm making a clear distinction from this day forward. We got a dictionary of what is and what isn't right. I mean, we're pretty pretty. Have you heard me call them fake detractors today?
No, because it's no, they're dead. It is, no, it is only fields. That's all they are. Each one of those channels is a, 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 the only field channel because that's all that's there. There ain't nobody else there but field. So that's what they are. They supply the glory hole. Y'all supply the, the sucking part of it. While they suck off field, you suck them off. And it's just one big circle of disgusting shit. And none of it is, is detractive behavior. I do detractive behavior. I'm doing detractive work right now, trying to hold them accountable, get them to answer for their bad, uh, their bad teaching, for their bad speaking, for their bad videos, for their bad behavior, for their bad treatment. I, I'm holding them accountable. I guess I am the gatekeeper. Since nobody wants to tell the truth from from the only field side, they just want to take money. Then, yeah. So, yeah, I guess, uh, yeah, I guess I am the gatekeeper, I guess. But I, I tell you what, it's not because people can't do the work. They just choose to do what's expedient. Said we talked about that today, this morning. So, or whenever you heard this video, if you saw the last video. Um, I just care about the truth, man. And, you know, my channel is at the truth phase, you know, after the... After the fluff and the, and the disgust and the fakes and phonies, after the, the, the queens, after, you know, the, 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 the men that rage quit manhood, after all that's gone, we're now getting to the truth of my channel, which is livable. You know, now it's a breath of fresh air to see I don't have to maintain something by making myself disgusting. There ain't been no field content in season two. It's just been me roasting these those only fields. And, you know, it's one of those situations where the roastings are based on the facts again. We mean, these are who these people are. They don't even deny it because they're going to say whatever they want to say on their own channel because they're God in their own channel. But they definitely ain't going to roll up over here and then try to say, where well, God am a real detractor because they know what I'm going to ask. OK, all right, playboy. How about we do the main one? What has your channel done to hold Phil accountable? And you, we all know how that conversation is going to go. I make videos on him. Show him who he is. I'm like, oh, this is like, it's trolling. Mm -hmm. We're in the age of trolling. Yeah. We're in the generation of trolling. These kids have figured something out. They figured out that attention is all that matters. The, the skill, because of skill, the quality, what the fuck about quality? The what? What are y'all talking about? No, all that matters is attention. Some of the you Yeah, get him the hell out of here, will you please? Get him out of here. Throw him out. <laughs>